Kicking off the 10th professional Pass the Parcel match tonight with all competitors in Halloween fancy dress for a special trick or treat episode. Shaheen, with a delightful cup design, very topical. Uh, one of your favourite times of year, Tina, I believe. Oh yes, I just love Halloween. Apple bobbing sweets, vodka. Vodka. 2011 was a cracking Halloween for the sport. I remember Farley Lettis breaking a run of bad luck with four wins on the trot. Not since the days of Graham Treehorn back in the late 70s have we seen that. A different type of parcel today, uh, just the one main prize with five numbers to be opened on each of the five rounds preceding the winning prize. Uh, each one reveals a house number on this street. The competitor holding the parcel as the music stops will head to the specified house and knock on the door for a trick or treat prize. Oh, Ew. Tina? I think that came from the playing area. Well, that was quite a guff wherever it came from. Uh, parcel in play. I'm just admiring the Shaheen pumpkin in the back of shot. Uh, I've been told that Quinn is responsible. Oh, and uh, and here's the footage from earlier today. Quite remarkable skills. Not only a world record pizza maker, but a talented pumpkin carver too. Uh, and one there at the side carved by Shaheen as well. Uh, music has stopped. Another Trump noise. Some embarrassed faces, but no one owning up just yet. Uh, Quinn opening number one underneath. We reveal a house number. Uh, number five. Uh, and now Quinn will immediately head to that house for the reward. Uh, this is the edited version, cutting out the travel time between houses so that you're not simply watching a competitor walking up the street entirely on their own. I'm sure nobody wants to see that. And here we are, Quinn is at the door. Very dark at this house. Um, quick knock. Let's see if they are in. Uh, yes, indeed. And there's a prize of uh, some beads. Well, that's an interesting choice of prize. Yes, it is. A uh, quick cut to Quinn back in the arena. And the music starts up again. Bailey to Shaheen, Shaheen to Scout. Quite an urgency to this match. I love the way this sport constantly reinvents itself. Quinn again with the parcel. Uh, a number 43 under the wrapper means that we can now cut to the arrival at the house. Uh, knocks on the door and it's quickly answered. A uh, small child there uh, with a broken chopping board. Now what are they going to do with that? Bizarre. Uh, straight back to the playing arena, which is simply the front room of a house on the trick or treat road. <coughs> oh dear. Ooh, sounds like it's coming from the uh, left hand side. Uh, possibly either Quinn, Bo or Bailey. Well, that doesn't sound like one of Bailey's. That's a fair point, Tina. There's uh, always a carburetor feel to those. Uh, Scout taking the third number, uh, house number seven. Surely we must have a traditional bucket of sweets here, but uh, nope. No, that's a vacuum cleaner filter. Yes, uh, it is. What is wrong with these people? Back in play uh, again. Uh, very glad we we're able to cut directly into the action, uh, removing the travel time in edit. Uh, parcel moving. Ooh. Oh, blimey. Wow. Uh, Quinn looking quite dismissive. Uh, Bo, on the other hand, uh, rather sheepish. My money's on Bo. Speaking of Bo, uh, Bo holding the parcel and revealing House 4, uh, which is uh, number 68. Magically cutting directly to Bo at the door. Uh, oh, and there's no getting away with that one. I thought I recognised that timbre. Bo trying not to look into the camera as the door opens. House owner uh, wafting the smell away there, I assume. Uh, and handing over a hairbrush. Well, this is getting really weird. Yes, uh, agreed. Bo, back in play, had a word to the location manager whilst returning from that house. Uh, apparently, it's the black peas that have adversely affected Bo. 
who uh, ate a full bucket of them last night. Black peas are, well, uh, we can see them on screen there, a, uh, a Lancashire delicacy, renowned around the Rochdale area in particular, and uh, simply dried peas soaked overnight, boiled, pardon you, boiled to within an inch of their life and eaten with vinegar. Delicious. Uh, Bo again with the parcel. Has Bo managed to contain the... Oh, no, I guess not. At the final house now, a uh, door opens, and the treat is a reusable water bottle. Speechless. And that's something for you, Tina. Final round. Uh, no more house numbers to reveal. The winner keeps the contents of the parcel. I wonder who it will be! It is Shaheen taking another win. Uh, we will be checking out the leaderboard at the start of the next match to see who is in the lead. Shaheen could very well be up there. And uh, revealing a ghost toy. Uh, very topical. And it lights up too. Uh, sounds like Bose Trumps have finally stopped. Oh, no. Can I have some of those peas? Oh.